Dear sisters in the Lord, yeah, it's me, Tina Weed from Altona. Can you hear me? Yeah, can you listen? My boy Hanson is here and he is wanting a video to be making for the grandchildren, yeah? Me telling stories. Okay, I am saying, I will stories be telling about my man Doft and about you, Hanson, yeah, and about your little boy, little Hanson, and maybe something about me, but not about the girls, yeah? The girls, Frida and Katie, they can their own stories be telling. But the boys, they are not liking to talk so much, or they are things up to making so they all look from, yeah, all pious. This is what men are doing, yeah, and it is giving my heart schmetz. So I, the true stories, have to tell so that my heart is not hurting so much. Hanson says, the pain in my heart, this is angina, but I think this is not so polite to be saying to your own mother, yeah? Am I not my own heart knowing? Hanson says, I must be English speaking for the grandchildren because they are not so much German knowing, yeah? They are French learning now in school. I am wondering why they can't more than one language be learning, yeah? Okay, but I will try. But please do not complain if sometimes I am saying things in German where the English I have no word, yeah? Because maybe they are not so clear thinking like auf Deutsch. Also, I am sorry, but sometimes I have to think and I have to look other places while I am talking so I am not forgetting the stories in English. Okay, says Hansen, you tell what you want. But first, I told him, I have something I am wanting to say to the women's Frauenverein. And Hansen is saying, well, we can do this on this video right now, yeah? Okay, so here I am, yeah? Can you hear me? Please. Okay, I have today a special request to the Mennonite Women's Society to put Salman Rushdie on the missionary prayer list. Sometimes when I have the chickens been feeding and the radio by the barn has been playing, yeah? Even like a mother hen, the Lord has me to the kernels of his wisdom being guided. Many times has the Lord reminded me from the days in Russia when the Indians in Quebec have their guns taken their graveyard to defend against a golf course. I have remembered the Bolsheviks and how they to our village came and a factory from the church made, yeah? Yeah, but this is not what I am wanting to say to you today. Today, I am wanting to tell you how I on the radio have heard that the Ayatollah in Iran is wanting the Salman Rushdie to kill because he is stories telling that the Ayatollah doesn't like ya. Yeah? And I am thinking then about how John Friesen has once a letter in Russia written to Stalin. And then they have come and they have taken him away just as he the Bible was reading at the supper table. And his wife Elsie and the five children have him never seen again. Elsie has told me that John the parable was reading of Jesus and the vineyard rented to the workers who all the servants of the owner killed, even the very son. And then John told how we the earth are renting from God. And when he comes to ask, well, how goes it? What can we say, yeah? And then the communists have come and John has been taken away. And then they have prayed and then they have schnetteke eaten. And there were, there were no Fleischpirischki, yeah, although they are wanting Fleischpirischki. But after Stalin's famine, no one had any meat, yeah? And I have told Elsie that God is in that story and how much Jesus is stories loving, yeah? Yeah, the truth comes to us that way. And then we can eat schnick and life is ongoing. Even then, yeah. And that is why Stalin and the Ayatollah and even some Christians do not like stories so very much. Because they think maybe God is in the story hiding like meat in a Fleischpudischki. And when we are the bun opening, God is on us checking to ask, yeah, how are we caring for the beautiful vineyard? This they do not like, that maybe God is looking. And that is why I am the church asking to Mr. Rushdie to be putting on the missionary prayer list, yeah? As the grain from the leaky pails to the, to the chickens falls, so God, through Mr. Rushdie, into the world comes, even if his story is not so very good, always are. And if we, the leaky pails, are making silent, then who among us will the Lord's voice be? Will not even the corn cry out? Yeah, so whenever we are schnick or fleischpudischki or platz eating, let us a prayer for Mr. Rashki be making. Even now, I have some plots in the oven baking. 
this is good, yeah? What else is there for an old lady to do here? And I can some of it be sending to you, yeah, my grand boy, my little grand boy Hanson, little Hanson, he will, he will bring them to you. But listen, Ma, while we are waiting, I have some stories for you, okay? <laughs>